Hey guys, it's Sean here. I uh, just wanted to record this quick video on uh, tips for new DMs uh, when, they're, when they're coming up with adventures. Uh, first of all, uh, for the first adventure for a new group, uh, I always keep it basic. Whether it's a bandit problem in a town or, you know, uh, I hate to go this route, but rescuing a princess. Uh, just because they're basic. They allow the player to role the players to role play, and you can have a lot of fun with them. But as more advanced, and if you want to get more ideas, I would recommend reading a lot. Uh, whether it's Tolkien, uh, Dragonlance, Forgotten Realms, anything like that'll do. Uh, even uh, science fiction like Star Trek, if you watch a lot of that, you can even incorporate that in a D&D game for fairly easily because it's all your imagination. Uh, another is, uh, along with that, uh, uh, I touched on that briefly with Star Trek, watch a lot of fantasy movies. Uh, you can find countless things off uh, YouTube, uh, Hawk the Slayer, Crawl, anything like that. Lady Hawk, uh, they just give you a sense and get you pumped for D and D and get your moods in. You, you mood in the right way. Also, constantly write. I find that if I'm writing and if I'm getting my ideas, I find that that helps me plan out a session. Um, and just go up with new idea after new idea, because uh, that's what we do as DMs. And uh, anyway, that's it with the. Uh, Tips on DM if I come up tips for new DMs. If I come up with anything else, I will make a next video. And I'll try to get more videos out uh to you on the internet, because I think you guys like you like to hear what I have to say, but uh I can't promise anything. I get busy just like everyone else, because I don't do this full time. And yeah, anyway, I'm John and happy gaming.